love with Pat's two cents. Sometimes grief can take us in different directions. We don't always know what grief is going to bring. For some of us, grief brings anger, real anger, oftentimes rage. There are times when grief brings such a deep depression that we literally feel like we want to die. But I want to share something with you. There's a scripture that says, Death, where is thy sting? Grave, where is thy victory? And the purpose of that scripture is to remind us that with God we always have a hope. Because when there comes a close of a chapter in our lives and we have to let go of someone we love dearly, whether it is through death or through the end or the close of a relationship or friendship. We have to remember that God's timing is always perfect. And when God closes one door, another one is about to open. But they don't happen simultaneously. They don't always happen one right behind the other. We have to remember God is wise. He said in his word, my ways are above your ways and my thoughts, your thoughts. So even though everything he does is so above and beyond our understanding, just because we don't get it doesn't mean it's not worth getting. It doesn't mean that God wasn't correct because we don't understand it or because it doesn't line up with our scheme of things. We have to learn to trust God even when his answer is totally opposite to ours. Don't be angry. Be grateful for the time you had with that individual. Be grateful because down the line for some of those broken relationships, you're going to learn some lessons and you're going to realize that it was good for God to see to that relationship coming to a close when it did. God's about purpose, your purpose. Don't allow your grief or your anger. Don't allow your bitterness to sour your destiny. Wait and see what God has in store for you. He says, I know the thoughts and the plans I have towards you. I'm paraphrasing. Thoughts to bless you, not harm you. To give you a hope. And the King James says an expected end. We call that a future. God bless you. Be encouraged. It's not over. Not for you anyway. Watch and see.